Rama, how was the panel? Uh, I thought it was uh, a very uh, a collection of some very distinguished people, and uh, you know, I enjoyed listening to different points of views. And uh, I think you did a great job collecting people who represented many different facets of right. the wireless communication, you know, from service pro providers to silicon suppliers to right. you know the uh, 3G representation and uh, etc. So, Thank very you. good. Thank you. Any other though, topics? Though um, you're not Bengali, but this is a Bengali convention going on uh, under the business section and uh, many communities from the India are getting mixed also. So what is your perspective in that? Well, um, so first of all, uh, you know, uh, I know this is sponsored by uh, NAVC, uh, but I, what I was uh, really, uh, um, you know, uh, interested in seeing the d discussion, the debate about how the uh, wireless, next generation wireless technology will help uh, uh, emerging countries and digital divide problems we have. And, and India and Bangladesh are right in the middle of that. So they represent, to me, you know, India and Bangladesh are test cases where the new technology and new paradigms will happen. And I know that there is a fair amount of activity in, in the WiMAX area, even in Bangladesh. So I, I see that uh, this uh, forum uh, was very timely to, uh, you know, to be organized, uh, sponsored by NIBC, to focus on the wireless uh, um, initiatives in countries like India and Bangladesh. You know. And for me, yeah, I'm not Bengali, but I have many Bengali friends, and I love Bengali sweets and Bengali culture and Bengali music, so to me, it's kind of a little bit of like coming back home here. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> also, uh, in the world, by the wireless technology, um, uh, I have just a general um, question about that. Like, many middlemen could be cut when the, in the villages the technology is readily and uh, inexpensively available then the farmers can find the market prices mm -hmm. and they can cut out the middleman and mm -hmm. they can make the real money mm -hmm. and uh, and uh, it can improve the rural economy of india absolutely uh, that's already that's already happening i think government has a mandate uh, bsnl is part of that uh, which is you know uh, close the digital divide get internet access and i think there is a uh, what they call it uh, the uh, bringing the urban uh, um, capabilities, uh, amenities uh, into villages by things like broadband is one of the uh, initiatives or mandates. So I, I know that from a government it's a very strong push. Uh, what's really important is for the industry to rise and support it and uh, you know really make it happen because I think uh, uh, India presents, represents a unique opportunity in terms of the uh, number of villages, number of uh, uh, people who can be touched by uh, you know, broadband just outside the urban environment in a manner which uh, can really change, uh, uh, can create a significant change both economically and socially, something which will be very, very uh, beneficial, not just for India, but all the other uh, emerging markets, uh, developing countries. I think India can lead this. You know, I, I have I made this co actually comment two uh, uh, regulators and the government officials when I've met that uh, the mobile broadband wireless technology presents India an opportunity to lead as opposed to follow. Uh, for it primarily for its own benefit first, but then it uh, has impact uh, globally, I believe. Thank you. Thank you Ch very much. Changes that were brought by satellite TV 10 years back, the same kind of changes can be brought about by wireless broadband mobile broadband services we today. Would, we would learn more from probably your, from your power seminar because many villages in India still Absolutely. don't have any kind of power, you know, electric power, so <laughs> no technology will be available there exactly. unless there is a power. So hopefully we'll learn something from your power um, uh, seminar. Exactly. Right. And uh, in the next um, forum after lunch, we're going to talk about how to get computing technology to the masses. So it's a marriage of the two that creates opportunity. Thank you very much, sir. Thank, Thank you. you.